Well, everybody knows that I love a lovely cup of tea. And there are a couple of places in Ann Arbor that not only have the kinds of wonderful teas that you can drink, but you can eat their tea as well. Meredith Bruckner is the local community news producer for AllAboutAnnArbor.com. And she found this places. And we're also with us is Lisa McDonald from the Tea House and Eat More Tea. Hi. Hi, welcome. Good morning. Good morning. And thank you for being back. Yeah, it's great to be back. This Happy New great. Year. Happy New Year. So yeah. what about these businesses caught your eye, Meredith? So I actually took a tea class um, at Tea House mm -hmm. in Carytown in Ann Arbor with Lisa. And a uh, little known fact, she is one of seven EU certified tea sommeliers in the U.S. So it's safe to say that Ann Arbor has its own national tea expert, right? Of course, <laughs> yeah. And you have a new friend in me. That's well, right. I love tea. Yes, Teach us perfect. this stuff. So you're going to show us how to make, brew the perfect cup of tea. Take us through this. Well, while I'm getting some of the, our awesome teas ready, we have over 180 in the store. So I had to narrow it down to a few. I apologize if I didn't pick your favorite. Okay. I'm but sure I'll like it. We, we, we can be friends if you like one of yes. them. So <laughs> but I'm going to start you off while I'm getting ready to brew some tea with a little toast. Now, I thought I was going to bring some champagne, but I was like, I don't want to get them all slashed up early. Okay. And then I saw you had vodka earlier. <laughs> Thank you. I know. Like, <laughs> what, was I, what was I worried about? So this is a, a fruit tea, and I like to actually mix this with a little bit of champagne or sparkling water. Champagne, of course, is better. So I'm going to yeah. have you two ladies. I've never had tea in a cocktail before. Oh, I'm we into do cocktail it. and yeah. teas all the time. Oh, oh yeah. There's a lot of local here. breweries yeah. and local bars that use our teas. So that is a fruit tea, which is wow. Really cheers yeah, with cheers. You. cheers. So yeah. without the alcohol, it's kind of like a healthy exactly. tea soda. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And all that is is hibiscus, rose hips, mm. dried fruit. All that gives you a new stuff. So I also brought some teas from Japan. Um, our sister city and she, our sister state in Shiga, had me in Japan over the summer, and I got some really cool teas from them. Nice. So all of these are different types of teas. I'm going to be brewing you my favorite, but I also did a little before and after. This is the tea leaf. This is what we're dealing with okay, let's here. Let's hold that up to the camera yeah. like this. So this is and basically your steady. normal tea leaf. <laughs> That's just a regular tea leaf. That is a regular okay. tea leaf, and that is what I'm going to be brewing for you. So I'm going to take my tea. So we sell it by the gram. By the gram. Yes. And it's loose. It is loose tea. Okay. Yeah. And we sell it very, yeah, you can buy 100 grams, 50 grams, 250, you can buy a kilo. Like, okay. And I remember this tea class. You told us that it's not necessarily about the time that you that you stew the tea, brew the tea. It's about the temperature of the water. Yeah, right? so temperature, time, mm -hmm. and uh, I think it's very important. So all of our teas will give you instructions about how to brew them and uh, so that you won't brew something gross at home. So this one I'm going to brew at 195, which I know is about 195 because I know my cattle. See those right. little fish eyes when okay. they start popping up? That's about 195. So I'm going to just pour You know it. what the bubbles should look like. I do. I love it. And so this will steep for about two minutes. Mm -hmm. And so why is the temperature of the water important? So different teas, it's all the same plant, white tea, green tea, blue black tea, oolong mm -hmm. tea, it's all the same plant. Um, it all has caffeine, it all has antioxidants, it's all healthy, sorry. I'm, I'm just gonna it's, burst your bubble there if you're yeah. thinking that you're getting all the health benefits one one or the other. But <laughs> the really cool thing about it is is that it's oxidized, like an apple. You know when you cut mm. an apple and it starts to turn brown? Right. That's what happens. So with the greener tea leaves, those are just picked and dried. The white leaves picked and dried. The black teas are gonna be like broken up, they're gonna be cut, they're gonna be torn, they're gonna be curled mm -hmm. to let the oxygen molecules in. Okay, so I'm all about the food. Oh my so God, tell us right? about how we eat more tea. Well, uh, I've been cooking with tea in my store forever. Our soups are made with tea, our, our salad dressings, everything in our stores we try Cocktail. to make with tea. Cocktails, mm -hmm. you got it. Um, and so I opened Eat More Tea because I've been doing spice blends Ooh. and I've been making spice blends for cooking for quite some time and more and more people kept asking me for recipes. Which, you know, I, I, I don't write stuff down. So at some point, yeah. I had someone sitting next to me. Okay, what'd you put in that? What'd right. you put in that? And we came up with our spice blends. All of our pastries are also made with teas. La la. These yeah. are so beautiful. So and even these yeah. macarons have... Yeah, mm. so like the, this one here is an Earl Grey mm. macaron. These are beautiful. marshmallows made with tea. Wow. Um, and these you were telling me about earlier. Yeah, those are moon cakes, and those are also all infused with tea. We make gelato with tea. Mm -hmm. So you try that just gorgeous. Are you, are you are you kidding me? Okay, okay. I, I'll try I it. Is that okay? I think you should try that. Right. Yeah. All right. So we've let that steep for about mm. a minute. About. I mean, we're you know for the for the sake of uh, what we're doing here, we're just okay. gonna <laughs> let it go a little bit faster. <laughs> so uh, you're not gonna judge me on the weakness of my tea, are no. you? No. Mm -mm. So. It sounds like Tati likes salty. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna like pretty much anything you make. So right. All right. Well, this is a milky jade oolong. This is a greener oolong that has been steamed over um, milk as opposed to steamed over water to stop the oxidation process. 
pretty good stuff. Oh, what say you? Yeah. It's good. Fabulous. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's really, it's really, really yummy. And I, okay, I'm. This is smooth. I promise. I, I'm yes. gonna pick on my leaf again. Sorry, folks. I'm gonna pick it up. But I'll tell you what. I'm gonna give you a little beauty secret here. Yeah. So. Uh oh. I'm just saying, Lisa I'm actually like 97 years old. Oh, I, I love it. You. We're hanging right. out. Yes. <laughs> Not quite that old. Next but, book, I mean, Beauty Secrets. This is about this, the eye. This I'm is it, saying. everybody. I'm just yes. saying. This is it. I know. So like after you brew it, like, oh my God, mommy, you stick it on your face. Leaves on TV. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I love it. But not when it's so hot. Right. That could lead to burns. That okay. would be good. So not only can you <laughs> drink tea in the form of cocktails tea. or as a traditional teacup, you can eat tea. Yep. Eat we tea. also Delicious. have a, all the brewing equipment that you need to so make So you're a, a one-stop shop for everything. Definitely. Yeah, you can okay. come and have lunch. You can come in and brew tea. You can come in. We have game nights. We have tango nights. So we, people can come and enjoy. Give us your location. We are located on uh, 204 North 4th Avenue and 206 North 4th Avenue in Ann Arbor in the Carytown District. Um, around the corner mm -hmm. is our Eat More Tea location, which is 211 East Ann. Perfect. Yeah. To learn more about these shops and what's happening in Ann Arbor, visit the website allaboutannarbor.com, which is made possible by our partners at Wallside Windows and Concordia University. Thank you, ladies. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.